Hey folks, good morning. Welcome back to the channel, Adventures in Vietnam. Cracker of a day. Uh, and a little adventure this morning. We were out for breakfast and then we saw the dad zip by on the bike with a huge delivery from uh, the Mekong Delta. And that's what we're gonna see today and, and a few other things. But anyway, stay tuned folks. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. And um, yeah, keep watching. Yeah, cheers folks, bye. Hey folks, welcome back to Adventures in Vietnam. We are currently in the farmer's fields about five minutes from our house. Uh, if you look around you, look, uh, these are the leaf vegetables that people will serve in restaurants. Wild West of the Central Highlands of Vietnam. So I don't know if you've noticed, but you can see, can you sense the lazy, take it easy kind of attitude? Not that people here are lazy, I mean. No, it's just this kind of laid back attitude that a lot of farmers have. They put a lot of hard work into their fields, um, harvesting their produce. It's a beautiful garden there, wow. They also take a lot of time and enjoy relaxing, having coffee, spending time with their family and their kids. So it's really, really comfortable way of life here. Despite some elements of poverty, you know, most people seem particularly happy. Come back. Yeah, cow. Channel Adventures in Vietnam. I'm currently at the family house in the countryside, and we had a delivery um, arrive. So I'm gonna hopefully get it. It weighs a ton. It's really heavy. Father-in-law brought it back on the back of his bike from the the bus station. So so here we go, folks. Yeah, that's what everyone's been excited about. God, these things are sharp. Jeez. Um, yeah, durian. So my wife's friend lives on the Mekong Delta um, and she has a durian farm. She's a durian farmer and she's a, I think she's an abacus teacher as well. But um, yeah, she, we bought a bunch of durian off her as you can see. So yeah, look, okay. <laughs> These things are super sharp, I'm telling you. Wow, what a smell. Yeah, some of them are open. Um, some of the smaller ones are a little bit sweeter than the bigger ones. But if you look, yeah, there's some there's some corkers in here. Wow. Oh baby, ickle, ickle doodia. But look, this one's ready to go. Look, it's bust open. Look, I'm bleeding already. Look. Jeez, these things are super sharp. Bugger. Wow, how many's in there? Oh, that's quite. Oh my god, these things are sharp. Oh yeah, there's some beauties in there. Wow. There's a different kind, can you yeah. see the difference here mm, from okay. between the skin? Are you filming still? So yeah. There you go. Look, there's two different two different varieties of durian. I'm not sure which is the best. More expensive. So yeah, this one's more expensive, okay. Yeah, I think the last time we were in the Mekong Delta, we had the smaller ones, no? Ooh. Okay, folks, again, hey folks, adventures in Vietnam. We just had a delivery of durian from the Mekong Delta. Um, this smaller variety is quite delicious, but this variety, as you can see, this is the best one. And they are super sharp. Look, I'm bleeding everywhere. Cuts and grazes from these things. We just got delivered. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 15, We've got 15 durians, or 16 durians of various sizes and well, there's quite a few of the smaller varieties. Look at them, they're kind of cool. That's really yummy. Yeah, these things are super sharp. Look at me, I'm getting I'm blood everywhere, bloody hell. It's like a zombie movie. Okay, folks, so anyway, if you're new to this channel, um, please stay tuned for um, our adventures in Vietnam. Um, 
interesting, funny little videos like this about durian. Maybe some of you in the UK or America, you've never tried durian. Your image is that it's really stinky and disgusting, yucky fruit, but actually, you know, the smell is really pungent and the fruit itself is really creamy. And I think some of these ones from the Mekong Delta, they've got smaller stones, so there's more creamy, custard-like goodness around it rather than the ones in the north tend to have a bigger stone and a thinner layer of creamy goodness but these i mean this fruit's amazing but i mean of course it's costly thanks for watching folks hit the thumbs up subscribe share leave a comment tell me what you think about durian or these videos in general thanks for watching see you Còn gì nữa không? Thôi à, move far away Gì nữa đi giờ Ba cẩn thận mổ hết mấy cái đấy Em, em đứng xích ra Một cái nghĩa là gì đủ tư Nó đang quanh một cái mắt của bự Nhiều quá gì đó Mút vô rồi bọc Người không chiên mà Ngon ngon ngon, xác xác đấy Anh thử chuồng bò đi để cho biết Cái giống thượng hạ nó như thế này Giống chuồng bò Đây là chuồng bò rồi đó Sau riêng chuồng bò ấy Dạ, sau riêng chuồng bò À, vậy là chắc nó nuôi nó trồng ở chỗ chuồng bò hay không? Anh đứng ra, nắm xíu đi con Nam, mời à Nam, watch out, look, granddad's cutting the durian Nam ơi, ông, 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 ông gỡ chưa có chiên hả con? Con, con ngồi xíu rồi, đỡ ra đến chút Ông gỡ không chiên lắm đâu You go handle with care Chưa chiên, chưa chiên, nấu à, ông móc ra nấu rồi cho chưa chiên Maya, wait. Sit down, thank you. Mm. Oh my god, it's open, it's like alien cocoon. Ah. Wow, there we go. Wow, look at that. Mm. Beautiful, creamy goodness. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> There you go, the ladies are there in the background. Mm. Mm. Saurin durian. Delicious.